Welcome back, everybody, and welcome to Roatan, Honduras. For this stop, we decided to book a cruise ship excursion, which is not something we typically do, but we kind of had a hard time finding something off the beaten path here. So we went down to the numbered area that matched our tour, hopped on a bus, and took about a 25-minute drive over to the boat area where it picks up. Um, pretty uneventful drive, but you'll see that there's quite a few ships in port. We counted four different ships here in Roatan in different areas. Once you got to the marina, you hopped on the boat to go over to Big French Key. Now keep in mind, there is Little French Key on the left side, as you'll see as we get closer here. There are two different establishments under two different forms of management. I know some people that have done Little French Key that loved it, but Big French Key is actually cheaper. So that's what we opted to do since we had a big group. As you can tell, the water is beautiful. They have different water sports that you can rent. A lunch is included as well. And they do give you a color-coded bracelet. So when you look at the board, you see what time your boat back is to the mainland. There's little shops and little massage suites throughout here. They have a variety of activities. There's restrooms so you can change your clothes as well. They have different activities for the kids throughout the day. You can snorkel here. And because there's a barrier just out here by the main part of the ocean, it makes the water inside the little marina area very calm. So great for kids. Highly recommend using water shoes here. It is a bit rocky. Olivia did not heed my warning and unfortunately cut her foot on something. So we decided to chill out with drinks. The Monkey Lala by far is my favorite. This is where lunch is served. This is the lunch buffet that is included. It's very good, but if this is not your style of cuisine, they do have other things that you can order as you saw on the menu earlier. Here's one of the kids' activities. They have to hit a pinata. You can either choose to relax up here on the deck or over on the beach. It's totally up to you. Overall, it was a really good experience. I felt like Roatan was a little limited, but check out this tour the next time you are in Roatan. Let me know if you have any questions down below. And if you're looking for help on booking your next cruise, please reach out to us. We've been cruising all over this globe and would love to help you on different lines. When you get back to the pier area, you get to go through all the gift shops, then hop back on board. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we will see you next time.